Hello everyone, welcome back to another brand new Roblox tutorial episode here. Just Roblox tutorial we're going to be doing is I'm going to be showing you how to make a viewpoint frame in Roblox Studios. Really simple, really easy to do, no script evolving. Let's get right into the video. So first off, what you want to do is you want to go to start a GUI. And we're going to go to click the plus sign and start a GUI. And we're going to get this screen GUI. But before we do something to screen GUI, uh, now if we're going to click this little gray arrow in this workspace, it's, we need going, we're going to need to do evolve something to the camera. So I'm just going to change the camera to like, you can change it whatever you want. I'm just going to change to main camera from now on. Now we're gonna go, you're going to select a screen GUI, click this plus sign, and you're going to search up a viewpoint frame. Now. Uh, you might you might be wondering for those new people in Roblox Studio, what is a viewpoint frame? A viewpoint frame is you get to you know those little frames, uh, the little GUI. A frame is usually like a background, you know, to have like a color background. But a viewpoint frame is you have an image in the view in the frame. You know, like no buttons or maybe you can add a button in it. But it's just mostly you get to insert a image or a 3D model inside a viewpoint frame. That's why they, that's why it's called a viewpoint. And this is a frame, so they decided to put a frame. So now uh, you're gonna select the model you want to put in this viewpoint frame. I'm just gonna search up a car, maybe if we can find a car. Ah, there it is. This looks good. Yeah, this looks good. So I'm going to select my model, and now. There is two reasons why this model is not in this viewpoint viewpoint frame. First off, uh, it does not have a current camera, and we did not select the car into our viewpoint frame. We will get into that later. So now uh, you want to go to select viewpoint frame, select current camera, and now it's going to show you like a brick something like in your mouse. So now I'm going to select main camera. So now since we did that, as you can see. As you guys can see, there is no, there's nothing still. That's because we haven't select our model inside a viewpoint frame. So if we select this car into the viewpoint frame, look at this. So the in, so the game it is disappeared. But the frame, as you guys can see, we have a car in inside of our frame. It looks pretty dope. You know, it looks pretty cool. You know, you could do stuff with it. But I want to show you guys a trick. Uh, what if like say you're moving, you do not want this car to move while you're moving. Really simple to do. All right. So first off, I'm just gonna select main camera. I'm gonna copy it and I'm gonna paste into. Once I did that, I'm going to select this. I'm gonna select the main camera to a VP cam, a viewpoint cam. Whoops. Viewpoint cam. There we go. So now uh, we're gonna go to viewpoint frame. Uh, we're gonna select current camera. Okay, viewpoint frame. Seems good. So now uh, we have a viewpoint frame here. Uh, main camera. I think we're just going to like uh, let's say hmm. viewpoint frame. VP cam. Hmm. Something seems not to be right. I'll be right back, you guys. Alrighty, guys. So I fixed the problem. I did the opposite. So, um, what you want to do? It's the it's correct. You want to copy the main camera, paste it into workspace. I name it VP cam. And now, uh, you see this? Look, 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 look. Current camera, get this, click the current camera, and select main camera. So now, if we move around, as you guys can see, the car is not moving around. So, there is, so that's basically it, you guys. Uh, you could do this cool stuff with it. It's just a short video. I just want to show you guys this viewpoint frame of what you can do. 
and uh, you could insert models or maybe some pictures or you could just insert text like car and maybe there's like an exit button so you can exit out and th and there's a frame and this frame could be disappear but it's still the same so if I go ahead if, if I play this game there we go guys so as you guys can see the car is still in the frame and yeah that's basically it for this guys uh, I hope this I hope this um I hope this was really helpful for your future Roblox game. If you do enjoy this video, be sure to smash that like button and maybe subscribe if you're new to this channel. And I will see you guys next time in my next video. Bye!